Yes, resonance over reach, exactly. And it's the idea of like, you can have a really, you can have a small number of people you have a very large impact with. And if you can do that, you can create a connection, you can create an affinity to your, to your brand um, that is extremely powerful. And people focus on reach and uh, they focus on reach for lots of reasons, like because anything we see has lots of views on it usually, right? Like because it gets shared around. And then if you're a marketer and you want to spend money on advertising, then you, the measure is often page views or views of the thing or whatever. Um, but we really, we're huge believers that if you can focus in on the core fans, the core people, the core customer, and have a much stronger connection with those folks, what ends up happening is you have, they have more brand affinity and they bring other people into the fold. Like they know the other people that are going to be interested in um, your company and your brand. Um, and it's actually about getting more targeted and more niche. And when you go too broad, then you're just, you're competing against everything. It's funny because it, it seems counterintuitive, but because the internet, like the internet's changed our culture so much, you know, everyone's been, you can go on Reddit and find a subreddit for literally anything. Absolutely, you know, weird, broken, old car subreddit. You know it exists. And you know there's people who are like, I found another weird, broken car. Should we fix it up? Should we do it? You know, like, is this a good buy or whatever? And like, um, that I think that part of the power is that because we're so connected with each other, things that were really niche are actually still really large numbers.